Hello my friends, my name is Artur Rey and I am an Estonian soldier. Kaalu päris palju see sõike, oh, võtad käete tunned, et on raske. Mostanees! The world's militaries are busy being funny and doing stupid sh**. That's what we're going to watch today. I'm still fighting depression. I'm having a good day right now. I don't know what's coming tomorrow. So I'm using this good day to make a video for you. But you have to know that I am fighting every day. But you have to have a sense of humor. And what else to laugh at than people in uniforms doing crazy stupid sh** that they regret their whole lives. Let's dive into it! Oh! We can't dive into it. I haven't shown my Rohya watch, and this is not a regular Rohya watch. This is a new one. Antarctica. It has a metal strap, it's really cool. It's a limited 200 piece edition. Straight from Finland, Nordic quality. No reindeer leather straps anymore, although you do get reindeer leather straps with it also, I chose to use the metallic ones. Finland is a long country, it has a very very cold north and even a very cold south, it doesn't have a warm place in it. And if this watch can endure the coldness of Finnish winters, then this watch can endure anything. I suggest you go and get the Antarctica watch on Rocky homepage, the link is in the description below. Let's go my friends! Ukrainian military! Woohoo! Go Ukraine! Be free! Oh, boy! Boy, boy! This is not the way to be free, my friend. It doesn't matter that you have a uniform on. You still are a human. You fall, you stumble. Somehow people think that if you have a uniform on, on you are this god that never makes mistakes. No. People in the military make stupid mistakes. I have done them. I'm not gonna show them to you because I have an image to, you know, hold on to. But I have done some crazy stupid mistakes. Everyone is a newbie at the beginning. So let's laugh at the newbies. Five, four, Three, two. They just blew a hole in the wall, they. <laughs> <laughs> them upper body gains though. If you're working out too hard in the gym, you can't really fit in the hole they blow. That's strangely sexual, damn it. I feel my English getting worse. I haven't made videos for two weeks. I, f I feel the effects already. Can you feel my strong Estonian accent? Can you? I sound like American, right? Oh! Tja, dabei sollte es doch eigentlich eine Friedenstruppe werden. Oh, sh oh boy! Oh, woo. damn! Oh, that's painful, right? He landed with his nuts on the camel's back. Yeah, ag again, this strangely sexual. Damn it! Camels are proud animals. You cannot bring freedom to them. You cannot bring democracy to camels. They won't accept it. They will just throw you off their backs. And this is a metaphor for Middle East. You cr can't really bring democracy there because they're not used to it. It's like a strange foreign drug to them. Doesn't work, it has a bitter taste. Leave now. That doesn't stop America from trying. <laughs> Russia. A pink guy. This is a random pink dude. Whoa, hey, whoa. No, no, no. You know why this happens? We are always taught in the military also, everybody who's driving is keep your distance, you will run into each other and it is bad, people get hurt. And no one does. Every winter when there's a slight sheet of icing on the road, there are accidents and sometimes you know you have 20 guys in the back of your truck, 20 conscripts and you're driving, you're a conscript. The road is damn slippery and you're not keeping your distance and if you crash you have 20 coffins in the back so that's not funny. That ain't funny at all but I mean people still don't care and they drift around in them and they do stupid stuff. People are in the uniforms are as stupid as everybody else. Like every... Just humans. I'm only human after all, don't put your blame on me. I can't put my blame on you, but you'll get court-martialed if you destroy a truck and get 20 conscripts injured. A parade in, in some country of Africa, I don't know which country is it. Forgive me. Oi! <laughs> Oi! This happens when you do crystal meth, don't do it. No, 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 
imagine if this would have to be a real frag grenade. A lot of dead people here right now. And the guy went in and he fell and he face planted right into the enemies. Imagine you're a terrorist inside with your Kalash and suddenly a group, you hear it like a pop and then explosions and then the first soldier that comes in face plants right in front of you. It's a kill shot for you. It can't be a professional right from the beginning. You have to be a newbie at first. Every general who you know has been a newbie at first and made stupid mistakes. This is how you learn. It's normal. But now we have, vi we have cameras to videotape and laugh at them. My friends, I have been away. I am depressed and right now it doesn't show because I'm having a good day and I'm trying to smile and trying to be entertaining to you. But I'm having a tough time. People who still support this channel through my tough times are really the heroes of my heart. I'm really thankful for you and you're really contributing to this. I am not forced to find a job while being depressed which is a very good relief to me. Thank you. It is all thanks to you, Patreons. I have three new names for you. The heroes of this channel. We have Corey Colby. Thank you for remaining a patron. We have Rutledge Williams. Thank you for remaining a patron. And finally, we have Marcus Brown. Thank you, Marcus, for remaining a patron. If you want to support the channel, Patreon is the best way to do it. You are such loyal fans. I wouldn't want anybody else to be my viewers but you. I have felt support throughout my depression. I read the comments, they are all positive. You, are, you remain active. Thank you so much for, for it from the bottom of my heart. This got really dark and deep. Okay, let's go on with the funny funs. This has to be Russia. Yes, this is Russia. Crazy stuff. Oh, we're drifting here. Yeah. Oh. You can see how easily the car moved, like these things are heavy as hell, the military vehicles and they're reinforced steel and cars are made out of like soft steel to protect the person inside, you know, the car has to take a hit. So if you really hit a car with a tank or whatever, this car will be demolished and the people inside it will be no more. But in Russia, I guess what happens now is they will drive away and not care at all. <laughs> Yeah, Bashli, yeah, let's go. Bashli, let's go. Of course, let's go. Civilian person, hit me. Not my problem. Oh, oh Russia. America. Why do you bring freedom to Middle East? Bring freedom to Russians. They need your freedom badly. Ah. Okay, this is the president of Zimbabwe or something. I don't know. This sounds really bad. Sounds really bad. Yeah, you get an award for being the di best dictator in the world and you drop the award. This is a lack of respect, my dictator. Be gone! Off with your head! Look how many medals he has. I wonder what he has done to earn them. Sometimes these uh, presidents or dictators just give themselves medals. But I don't know the case. Don't blame me. Don't court-martial me if I don't know the information behind this. A squad of US troops! Oh, one fell! And they all have night vision, look at this. One night vision set is about 10k, even more. We have them in Estonia, the US night visions, we have them in Estonia. Uh, we can't buy them, we can't, uh, they're loaned. US military loaned Estonia their night visions. They're so expensive. I remember one conscript lost a night vision. It's 10k in Estonia. This is a huge, huge amount of money. Impossible for a conscript to pay. I was the guy to turn to if you needed to make a video in the whole of the Sony military. So the upper guys actually gave me an order down to make a video. Everybody search for the night vision. It might be stolen or whatever because it's so expensive. And Estonian government and military have to report to the US military why they don't have that one night vision because we're not allowed to sell them because they are given to us uh, in goodwill as a loan. So if we sell US military gear or lose it, it's very suspicious. We had to find it. I made the video, it got a lot of views. Russian spies took it. I remember I insulted the Greek military at some point. The next video I've seen is the Greek military and they're doing their fancy march thingy, which I laughed at and the whole Greek population got insulted at me and they commented a lot. We're gonna watch it again and let's see if I have changed my mind, if they look ridiculous or not. They do look ridiculous! What is this? Wooden shoes. Guys, drunk falling, it's haha. Right, don't you think? If you're Greek, explain this to me. If I'm being too mean right now, because I find this funny. US Honor Guard looks good. 
they are precise, they look thick, they, they look on point as hell, and they are very precise, but this looks just like uh, children with the uh, children playing around. Next video is from Estonian military. I didn't know if it was here, I just saw it and I wanna, you know, introduce it. I think this is the only Estonian military fail video that is out there publicly. <laughs> Yeah, they speak in Estonia. Oh! Oh! Yeah, this is Kuperianum. This is my battalion. Damn it. If the lieutenants know this video is up, these guys are punished for sure. But this, he cracked his tailbone. Damn it. Maybe he wanted to go to the hospital. People do that sometimes. If you don't, they don't want to take part in the, you know, training, which is really tough, they injure themselves to go to the hospital. And this is being weak. <laughs> See, that's the stone of military right there. <laughs> what do we have? A javelin. Very expensive shot. Come on, Mosey. Come on. Come on, Mosey. You can do it. Come on, Mosey. In the name of the law, shoot it! Oh! Oh, oh shit! Oh. Don't run, don't, don't run, run, don't run, 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 don't run, don't run, don't run, don't run because uh, I don't know if this is true, but I've heard that yeah, if, if it doesn't shoot like that, sometimes it happens, it won't explode. Because it's not activated or something. Like, if you know how the javelin works, if, yeah, if it fails, it lands right in front of you, it's not supposed to explode, right? Don't run, don't run! Don't run! Don't run! Don't run! It's not gonna do anything. Yeah, it's not gonna do anything. Oh, we got a tank. Oi, oi! Look how much stuff fell off of the that tank. I don't know if it should do that. Like that many things falling off. It's a Russia tank. That's why. I've seen this one. Target on the over there. Christ. Tell me where the throw what the hell is going on over here? Bad buddy, come on, bad buddy. Tell me what, throw my grenade, bad buddy. Get the cover, bad buddy. Oh my God, this is. I know they're forced to be. Forced to do it to force communication between soldiers. They're really fresh, I can tell that. And we were forced to do the same, but it sounds so damn funny. Battle buddy! It's like me playing with my friend in kindergarten and playing war, you know. Hey, battle buddy, we're gonna take the hill, battle buddy! But I mean, if they don't learn that here, they're not gonna communicate in the on the battlefield, which means dead soldiers. So they need to do this, but it's funny as hell. <laughs> Blank him! Change him next! Change him! Battle buddy! Well, I'm gonna throw my grenade! Well, cover him down there, can you? No to a part. Yeah, really sloppy and slow change, right? Okay. It only works if a round is in the chamber. You gotta cock the gun, yep, good. Tell me what's on my grenade, battle buddy! Got your cover, battle buddy! Oh, yeah! Uh, yeah, okay, break up. I don't remember what happened. What's in front of you? Enemy Joe Surgeon. You're over there, right? Yes, Joe Surgeon. Where'd your go? Over the left, Joe Surgeon. Drill Sergeant, I dropped my grenade somewhere over there. Sergeant, I dropped my grenade somewhere over there. I'm gonna get back to my depression. You wait for the next video, it will come. I'm getting myself cured, so I will try to produce as much as possible for you. I'm fighting every day, every day I wake up. I'm gonna make a video today and then I can't, I'm not able to. But today I was. You can feel something different with me. I feel something different with me. But I'm trying, I'm fighting. I'll get over it and I'll be publishing as the old times, I promise you that. You at the meantime go and get the Stonen YouTuber Cup and the Stonen Soldier Hat. Thank you to those loyal fans who remained throughout my depression. And I hope I will see you in the next video. Stay cool and bye bye.